Hi everybody, this is Milky. Today we're gonna start our new gameplay series of Scroll of Taiwu. Scroll of Taiwu is a really fun game. I already put some hours into it and made a review video for it. So feel free to check it out if it happened and we will start a new save file. Well, I'm still learning this game because it's such a complicated system and uh, let's create a new a new save file. Um, I think I'm gonna name myself Miki Miki and uh, it follows the same look I created last time. So for the birthplace, I decided to go to Sword Manor because I heard it's a uh, best sack so far. So your usually your sack depends on your birth area and each birth area have their own unique sack and I decided to go with this one. And for the word details, I do wanna be life stand normal and the rest is just default. Then another thing that's really important to choose from are traits. So I already kind of decided what traits I would need to select for this save file because um, yeah, it took me forever to put, look into each of these traits and uh, pick them. It was uh, really painful and uh, I, I doubt you would like to look at me doing it, but I could make an intro video. It kind of uh, explain what each trait does and some recommendation for different build. But I'm, I'm still learning this game, so I might not be 100% correct or suggesting the optimal trait. So the most important thing of this trait is the secret friend. So once you select secret friend, you will have an inseparable childhood friend adding a starting party, party member of the opposite gender, which will usually become your wife. So you're born with a potential wife. How nice is that? And then we need the call from nature, um, astrolo astrology and witchcraft. We need creativity, potential radiance, and then the convergence of sharp blade. One thing that's really important is uh, because we're going with a sword sack, so we want something that helps us with crafting sword. sword. Ooh. And uh, I think potential radiance is also really important because we will need to make breaks breakthroughs. But we can talk about more about it once we start the game. So let's start it. I think this is a great start. Wait, let me just check my standpoint. Yes, even is good. So what's your your standpoint kind of also matters because um, it depends on how many support you will get to your sack. So some sex really likes just people or some sex really like rebels. So if you decided which sack you want to go, then it's better to choose a standpoint that's corresponding to it. So we started to living with our adopt adopted father. We call his our Yifu. And then we started with a uh, Ancestors long feast. Sure, we'll pr pr practice it. And then, oh, this part. I t it took me so long to decide, but this time I know what I want. I think I will go with Wu Dang because we can learn Tai Chi feast. And Wu Dang is really famous for like internal arts. So I'll do that one. And he will teach us Wu Dang swordmanship. Sure, let's follow it. So we get a swordmanship book and the sword, which is great. Oh, this this happened again. I'm not sure what is it, but it can be fixed soon. After this dialogue. So I'll need to exit the game in order to fix it. Give me a sec. Okay, so I p came back to the game and the problem is fixed. Now, I think I will start selecting to do both because we do need the wheelbarrow. I think what it does is it increases our speed. Also, we can start by looking at our straight. So our fascination, it's ordinary. Reputation is unknown. Mood is regular. 
standpoints even. So, so far, our, I think our stack looks normal and we can see our features. Begins of summer, shoot. Weak wield. Oh no! Floating pulse. Potential. Increase your success rate of breakthrough. Yeah, that's because we click on one of the trade convergence. Increase your success rate of breakthrough. Again? Okay. So far, so good. Oh, and that's how we're. Um, that's our potential future husband. He has a really good trade. He's blessed. He's uh, robust as a beast. Wow. So great. So what we could do is we can take this out. Take this on there. Oh no, why? Why every time? I think every time we saw the sword or see this, it, this start happening. Um, let me go out and fix it again. So I'm back with fixed state and I uh, just want to make sure we don't have anything else. And the first thing we need to, need to do is probably fix the wheel barrel. And I think the way to do it is using the carpentry. But before that, we will need a bundle of wood white oak, carpentry box, and uh, our broken well. And the thing we need to do then go to carpentry and thus repair. Select the toolbox, select this, put resource. Well, how many resources do we have? Right now we don't have any, but overall we will need seven so i guess we need to collect some wood maybe that's how it is and for the white oak maybe we can do wood dagger lack of resource it's still lack of resource Don't... hmm not sure why oh because then we need 60 wood I see. So we definitely need wood and uh, here. Maybe we can destroy it by. Oh, but we don't have labor. So we actually have to go out and. Uh, let's go leave the area and collect some wood around here. So the way you move is just using the WASD or clicking. And here's some chirping cricket. Yeah, let's go for the cricket. Let's look at the map. So far, I think we can look at the cricket. Milky Milky hears weak sound in front of the grass. Found a hidden little monkey. The little monkey looks at Milky Milky with his big eye, trembling. It quick so I quickly recognize that it's the one frequently bagging food near the hut. Oh, let's check in the little monkey. We found the numerous wounds on the little monkey, luckily no fatal ones. The little monkey looks at Milky Milky for a while, recognizes Milky Milky and begins to gesticulate. With great difficulty, Milky Milky finally understands that. Wow, we were able to understand him? Recently, there were numerous fights among the monkeys and lots of the little monkey got injured. Then a monkey leader of some pack found some wooden Golems conquered all other monkey and became their king. The little monkey stops gesturing because of pain. Oh, that poor monkey. Let's take care of him. Heal, leech, heal the little monkey teaches it that vengeance will never stop bonding. Uh, sure, because the thing is, if we pick the option that matches our standpoint, standpoint it will make us happy. See, the mood of our mood will get better. The little monkey looks confused while listening to Miki Miki. After Miki Miki finished treating its wound, it gets some hidden fruit from the rock and put them into my arm. Oh, thank you, monkey. Before Miki Miki comes over, it limps up to the tree and vanishes into the jungle. Now monkeys get their kings. I'm afraid that they may har harass the hut. Where's their king? So maybe we need to fight the king, but I don't think we're as strong yet. Dated wooden. 
when Milky Milky is walking around, a wooden golem suddenly appears from the rock and throws a stone towards Milky Milky. Oh, monster! Is that the king of the mu the monkey? I dodge the stone and hear two angry chatters behind the golem. With the chatter, two monkey drives the golem towards Milky Milky. It seems that they are committing a robbery. Oh wow. So I take on one step ahead with a shout. The monkey shrinks back behind the golem and begin to operate in the golem with their clumsy hand, throwing stone towards us. Okay. So we will have to fight the dated wooden and two monkey. Okay. It's odd. The golems are so weird. Did I see them before? Those golems look so antique. They seem to be abandoned ones made by dad before my entrance into the valley. It can only attack unable to move. It seems like it can be beaten easily on leaving its attack range. Sure, so I think the thing we want to focus on is the leaving. I actually don't know what's a better way to s or change the attack rank. Because every time they move, it's really hard to stop. How to stop it? Auto combat? No, I don't want to auto combat. I want to know how to stop a compact. I think. Right now, I want it to be 7. And then I can use maybe stone. Yeah, now we did it. But I thought we we're out of the range. Let's start moving, shall we? Yes. Okay, I think we're gonna be out of range soon. I still have something to learn about the compact overall. But we did get a lot of wings and we got a flying stone. Nice. Some berries, which is also nice. Milky Milky knocks the golem down. Once the monkey discovered that tank that the tank the, the tank they rely on has been broken, they flee quickly. That said, it's chaotic outside. However, even in the isolated valley, you cannot avoid the hardness of the monkeys. Chew. Let's see whether we can put this on it. The flying stone. I think we can put it here. So, I wonder how do we ask them to help us? Because the last time I started, I didn't have I didn't have a friend with me. But this time I do. Maybe we can interact with him. Is it possible? Oh, here we can interact. We can chat. Learn arts become closer and chatting. I heard chatting makes us become closer too or quickify competition or learn arts i think the thing about it is i need to know whether he knows any art or not does he oh he has a really great talent for buddhism well he looks like he does because uh, he has a let's see kick Okay, so I'm trying to check what kind of uh, stuff he know, and uh, I don't think he knows any. Well, that's all right. Then let's go get trinket. Well, cricket. Also, I feel like let's see how many woods is here. Sixteen. Uh, forest looks like it could have a lot. Yes. Then let's collect wood. Awesome. So I actually didn't calculate how many wood we would need for um, for fixing the wheelbarrow. We'll have to look take a look later. But first, let's get a tree cricket. That could be fun. Yeah. So we can do it by going through adventure and putting our insect net. Let's go for it. I think catching the cricket part is really fun. 
And the, the way you can change the arrangement is by selecting here. Cleverness, ability to identify strange things. I think so far fortitude might be better. Also, we have a really strong fortitude. So I'm going to use arrangement to go fortitude way. Oh, fight again? I don't really want to fight. The battle is to the strong. Start battle on distance 3.0. One for all and all for one. Comrade will help you more positively. Oh, maybe maybe that's nice. I, I never tried it before, but why not? Let's go for it. Okay. We're out of range for him at the start. That's nice. Oh, and he died immediately. That was, that was fast. I didn't even do anything just yet. Bamboo dart. Oh, also really nice. Some nice stuff that we got. So I do want to get equipped my bamboo dart. Or maybe I could give it to him. Now, nah, let's put it on ourselves. <laughs> I'm not sure whether we need to give him weapon or something like that. Pure purple grass. Cool. So I think this is... Oh, got some bamboo. Adaptation. Okay. This is the water area. Oh, we need to fight with the... The monkey. Okay, please help me with it. Also, I don't know what's this thing. Like this little tiny white thing. Plan. I see. Plan level. And uh, if we use our opponent, we can go to... Ah, how to change it? That's my question. Like, how do we change it? Yeah, I would like to go to... Oh, no. No. I don't want to get attacked too much. So let's do flying stone. Oh, wow. That was really harsh. And uh, let's do this one. Okay. I think... I'm not sure how, how could we pause the fighting so I can learn how to do it. I'll, I'll look into this before the next video because right now I'm just really bad at fighting. Oh gosh, we need to fight again. Okay. So I would like to do this one, this one maybe, then we can attack him. And uh, so far, we need to move to 6.5, yes. Then he can't attack us, right? Hmm, how to pause the fight? That's my question. Oh wow, we got some good stuff. Some bamboo. Let's see. Prolem bamboo. Sword looks pretty good. Exile low. Dart, stone, or sword. Mm, value 100. Good. Oh, and we also have uh, efficiency on it. I see. It's pretty interesting. But so far before I get to understand the system, I'll keep doing this. Oh no, I don't really want to... Focus on speed. Uh, opportunity favors the prepared mind. I think we should do... Circle the wagons. Increase focus on rising the speed. Okay. As long as we get out of here. And then we use this. Huh. But then we, we will still have a similar kind of attack. So maybe we should use this because we're really proficient at it. 
Okay, we still kind of win, even though I'm really bad at this. And we got some more bamboo darts. Another thing I think we need to do is make sure we assign this. Right now we don't have it, but enforced energy here to have more force than little. Well, right now I don't know what all this does. Internal here. Edges. Increase all defense. Yeah, I think that's really important. So this one reduce breeze disorder. So I think this one is also a defensive move. So I would want more defensive stuff. And then more damage penetrated and uh, more flexible. Okay, I think so far so good. I'm just gonna assign it like this. That looks good. I, I might be really wrong. I'm still kind of uh, learning on things. We can see our my blade talent is pretty good. Inner talent is pretty good. Polar talent is pretty good. So that's nice. And uh, what about other skills? My Buddhism is high. Crafting is crazy. And the medical and the carpentry. Nice. Okay. So I'm not sure whether this is a good start or not. Drove away some strange bird. Improved the chance of better cricket by 10%. Nice. Nice. Oh, I'm so looking forward for us to actually catch the cricket. So the thing about it is I think we need to listen for the loudest one. Basically look at the circle. So this is a tiny circle. It's a big circle. This one seems pretty loud. Oh, oh wow. Red loot wings. That looks pretty good. Wild loot 900. I, I don't know how good it is. Sensitivity adoption. It's a general. Looks pretty nice. That's actually the first time I got a semi good looking cricket. Also, catching insect is very quiet. It causes all the nearby sensitive insect to flee away. You're surrounded by silence and cannot hear crickets, crickets anymore. Okay, let's go somewhere else. So we catch the cricket. Then we can use the carpentry to fix the wheelbarrow. Okay, I do think we still need it. So we can go down here, here. And uh, I'll need to find out how many wood will we need to repair this, right? So it needs one, two, three, four, five. It needs seven, and we will need 175 wood. Sure, no problem. Let's go get more wood so we can finish this two thing. Can we get wood here? No. So maybe we can walk this way and uh, collect some wood. Not enough time for action. We only have one time left. Maybe we can use it to interact. Here, let's chat. Improve their relationship points. Awesome. Its impression for me is wild man. Oh, so that's why I realized why finally they think me I'm a wild man. It's because I was wearing this. So this gives people impression, wild man. Well, I didn't want it to, so last time I take off it and talk to whoever I was really I was trying to get better at, and they were shaming on me for not wearing clothes. So be careful if you don't get any clothes, you know, just wear something. <laughs> and uh, I think now we can go to the next season. Oh, I think something happened. It's uneventful, sure. But based on the review, improves our relationship. Also strengths the wild man impression? Please don't. That's scary. 
But so far so good. We already finished one thing. We just need to fix our wheelbarrow and uh, that looks good. So that's it for our first gameplay video of the Scroll of Taivu. I know I'm still learning the system and probably made tons of mistakes if you already played the game. But I hope you still enjoy the video. If you do, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Leave the comment down below if you think I did something wrong and uh, I would love to hear as much feedback as possible. I'll see you guys next time!